But guys, we are going to jump into today's map and we're going to kick things off today with a clue by Fumbly Bumbly, which is an easy difficulty. The severed path curls back to form anew. A remake of the map a clue and as always report any bugs and uh, issues. Alrighty then, what's going on Mika? Welcome, welcome. Hope you are well this fine day. I guess we're going to like travel through there with a light bridge or something. To be honest, I can't actually remember the original map too much, so this could be interesting. So let's do this and this and try and make our way through the big hole in the glass. There we go. That's a way for us to return, potentially. There's no floor portals. Something I should have checked though is I'm pretty sure I'm not meant to uh, put anything up there. Alright, so we'll jump down for now. I don't think we need to do anything else on that side and run over to here. Alright, I'm guessing we can Provide ourselves a cube. And that's what's going to give us our light bridge. I'm guessing that is not portable. Oh, it is portable. Okay. Interesting. Oh, interesting. Yo, Mika with the gifts up to crazy. Mika, thank you very much. Crazy, welcome along. Enjoy that uh, if tier one gifts up from Mika right there. Okay, so now I can <clears throat> make my way back. I'm in this direction, however, we need to get rid of this, don't we? Okay, so now we're going to do this. <laughs> Snooze, you lose, I'm afraid, uh, crazy. <laughs> I'd say, yeah, we'll work away. Backwards like this to here. I guess that's what uh, the part about going backwards and winding around and stuff was alluding to. But Bonky, what's going on, buddy? Hope you're well. How are you doing this fine day? Okay, so here's my issue. So, I can, um, I could fizzle the cube now, and that would give me a light bridge over there. Go on, Doctress. Let's, um, let's play on that for a moment. We can do this. Uh, mistakes were made. Mistakes were made. Reload the save. <laughs> Crazy has extended the sub as well for uh, two months in advance. Thank you very much, buddy. Appreciate that. Okay, so then we can do this, which giveth, giveth 
the cubeth. And we can go back this way. And we shot the wrong portal again. Because I'm an absolute dumbass. Alright, let me take this over here. Glad to. Well, it's greatly appreciated, Mika. I know you wanted to give me the uh, the Walking Dead, um, which I already own. So, again, uh, much appreciated, buddy. Thank you very much. Knock you, tax. Oh, my God. This guy are bad. And then we'll work our way backwards, I guess. To here, then walk through, respawn the cube. But it's not quite as clear cut as that, is it? Because, 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 because. Where does the cube go? It's all well and good that I could. Respawn the cube. Well, it's, it's appreciated me. Ah, uh, crazy. Thank you very much. Yeah, you see, this is the issue here. I don't have a way to get the cube back, do I? And I completely messed that up. Went super cheap on Steam sale. I think Portal's like pretty much always on sale, isn't it? I know when I, I purchased it, um... It was on the old. Um, let's do this. It was on the. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I mean? It's on the yeah. I I pushed it when there was um, I think all the Valve games were like in a bundle together. Uh, years ago. <laughs> Poor Ponky gets me. He's like, yeah. Alright, save here, because we need to work out what to do with this. I mean, there's no way we can get the cube there. Respawning the cube seems like it's what we're going to need to do. Unless... How many blocks is this? Three, two and a bit blocks? How high is the cube? Okay. But if I was to do that... Mm, no. I was thinking what I could maybe do is I get the cube to like drop through the floor and then up on this and then catch it on the light bridge, but that's not going to work because then I won't be able to get back up here myself. Crazy, thank you very much for the host, buddy. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. Everybody's being... Most generous this fine day. I, I really appreciate your support, guys. Thank you very much. It means a lot. Um. Sharing the sport spirit, man. You've got to share the port spirit.
I mean, I don't know about that. I don't know. That is the right thing to do. Well, I don't know how else to get the cube. I don't think this is the right thing to do, like, fizzle the cube, re-fizzle the cube, and then walk over here and do that. I, I don't know. That seems a little bit finicky. And plus the cube keeps, like, going off there. So it's, it's not consistent, and I don't think the Combly would use that. Let's go cut the grass with the grass cutter, the lawnmower. Lawnmower. You're going to go cut the grass with the lawnmower, Mika. <laughs> well, enjoy, buddy. Thanks for hanging by, and thanks once again for the, the gift sub there. It's crazy. Uh, much appreciated, as always. And Have a nice day. We'll catch you next time. Just massively overcomplicating this, probably. I mean, it's only meant to be an easy map, right? It was supposed to be so easy. Uh, I looked. At, I watched the video. I, I said this to you the other day. You may have missed it when I said it, uh, Doctress. I did watch the video, and it looks very, very interesting indeed. Seems like like quite a powerful kind of tool to use, indeed. So, yeah, no, it looks very interesting. Got a few new objectives for me to complete. Uh, I haven't looked at like, the pricing or anything on the game yet, so uh, I'll need to uh, have a bit more of an in-depth look at it. The other thing I was thinking here is um, if I could drop this panel, I could have a there and there. So maybe I need to go. Maybe I go over here. There, uh, no, because I would lose the. I'd lose the surface there. Yeah, I'll have to look into it. Um, I won't be able to get it straight away, definitely. Um, Doctress. Um, so I've got, like, my son's birthday coming up and some other bits and pieces that we need to do around the house so um but if i do end up with uh, as soon as i do end up with like 
that I'll definitely have uh, a bit more of a look into it. It does look interesting. It's quite a powerful little, uh, I'll say little, it looks like a powerful tool actually. Hold on, what if I was instead... If I leave this one here, then respawn the cube... That's it. I think that's it. Yep. Did it. So I was pretty sure that there wasn't going to be anything too complicated in that because uh, probably only rated it uh, an easy. There we go. Awesome source. Cool map. Cool map indeed. Like working I always like those maps where you have to kind of you work yourself you work your way all the way to the end and you kind of like have to maintain your portal man you have to do portal management and um you have to um uh Yeah, you have to do your portal management and then you have to like make your way back to the start keeping port. Sorry, I, I like totally um lost what I was uh my trailer thought there. Which is uh crazy, crazy, crazy. Um Yeah, anyway. On to the next. Uh this is Nutcracker by Mid. I'm guessing it'll be a hammer map coming from mid. Let's take a look. A football concept map I put together around two years ago. Mr. Lambert Marie made it in Hammer, and I've been sitting it's been sitting on the PC his PC ever since, sorry. I think we've lost the ability to edit it, so there better not be any huge flaws. Three to five out of ten. Throwing a football in midair is not intended in solution, should be easy enough to execute that you could do it with one hand. Alrighty then. Alrighty then. So it looks like we need both of these for the exit. Mm -hmm. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Pretty sure. Pretty sure you can like have these going up and down. The, the problem is when you like release the footballs, they kind of like go at a weird angle. There we go. So that like, makes me do that. So now I could take this one. And do what with this? Pull over here. But by doing that... Would I ever accept... Uh, map request from chat. Yeah, if, if I haven't got like a pre... Um, if I haven't got like a pre-orchestrated um, list of things to do, then yes, I would. I wonder. I bet that's the idea. Using one food ball to destroy another. I've 
fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I do feel like that is the the play here. I don't really see any other way to do it, if I'm honest. And it's kind of alluding to the fact that that's you, you put it in the portal, so. Um, so how do I how did I pick that up when I didn't even press E? It's kind of spooky. Oh hey there, Fumbly! You just uh, you just actually missed uh, your own map. You just played a dude from yourself. Nice map, indeed. Did I make a save there? EA Sports. Do they even have that intro on their games anymore? I mean, if this is the solution, uh, hmm. Although, hold on. I mean, I don't see any other way to do it. One thing I can't remember, though, is these things. I always do that and then that. Yeah. That does break that. Hmm. Can I use that to sort of advantageous play? Football debris is like flying away, isn't it? Burger Green, what's going on? Welcome back. Just got back from school. Did you have a good day? Or is that a silly question? Is like, is it even possible to have a good day at school? Maybe, maybe we could have them both in the portal. They're going to collide midair somewhere, right? And then they're going to um, destroy themselves.
Why does the blue one sort of like go loads further than the orange one did? Yeah, you see, they destroy each other at the same time. Oh. Oh, wait a second. Ha. <laughs> Alright, I see it. I seen it. I see what it is that I have to do. The the portals are just literally to hold the bits. And then all I need to Nock said in his calmest voice. That ain't right. Okay. I need to swap these. So what I need to do is I need to put this one on here. Have the blue one in my hand. So then I can respawn the blue one. And that will kick off this one. And everything will work out hunky-dory, right? But yeah, I need to I need to get both of these on the portals, but be able to like turn around. So yeah, I, that's it. But I just got to delay. I've got to delay my uh, blue one as long as I can. All right, Doctress, no worries. Uh, it's not for a few weeks yet, but thank you very much. I got this now. Okay, swapped. And yeah, now I take this one. Are you secretly my son crazy? Rather than being at school, you're secretly on Twitch watching me on Twitch. Okay. So then... I need to do... This. Okay. That was cool. That was cool. <laughs> um, yeah. 9th of July. Uh, about 15 days before my son's but yeah um, kind of seemed like the trick shot for a start but uh, yeah it was too finicky and then 
obviously I tested out that theory before about taking it and swapping it and seeing what would happen when the other one respawned. Um, but yeah, it's just a matter of like getting these two swapped. And uh, yeah, cool, cool idea. Cool idea indeed. All right, so now we have Antares The Escape Part 3 from Sky for it. Let's get ready for an adventure. You're back in the Antares production facility, but you must escape. You'll come across test chambers along the way, but you will make, but will you make it out alive? Sorry. It's up to you to not get slammed, shredded, crushed, etc., etc. This should be the final of the series. All right, then. See another chair mission coming on here, boys and girls. We know how the uh, the previous chair mission went. What a huge success it was. Or is it like a clip there or something? Generally, like something stopping me from like walking across. Yeah, there's like a clip or something here. Don't know if I'm just like hitting the bottom of this, maybe. I don't know. Am I alright? Seems a bit off. No, I'm perfectly fine. I am perfectly fine. Thank you, Doctress. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I guess it's like maintenance access or something, maybe fumbly. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? I guess not. Oh man, all of these chairs are like tied down. What's all that about? Alright, so maybe we need to find a switch of some description. Because we're not going anywhere that way. Maybe we can take a turret. Um. Well, the door shut slammed behind us, so... Um... Oh. Look up, knock. Look up. Here's the part where it tries to crush me. I love the fact that it's somebody's job to like sit there in between these two crushing pistons. We're getting rather um was it R? Yeah. Uh we're getting very close, I think, towards the end of the queue actually. Crazy now. I will be honest. Where was the funnel? I thought I'm sure the funnel was there. It's there. There it is. I could hear it, I just could not see it. There be rumblings. Sky Ferret loves like the like animated and uh, like segments. Pretty cool. We have to get over to there? No, I guess not. 
Got a stretch and a hydrate from uh, doctors. Thank you. I need to go through the queue and get like get it all up to date and everything taken off that's on there that I've done and basically start afresh. Um, oh, so the gel stopped. Did I take too long? Did I, do I lose? Oh, I guess I've reached the gel limit. Yeah. I guess I reached the gel limit. I hear a bird, but I don't know if that was like... I, I couldn't like work out whether or not that was like on the game or if it was genuinely outside my window. I think it's outside the window though. I guess we can do this. Alrighty then. Very disappointed that I've not been able to destroy any chairs yet. It's one fast elevator. And destruction has cometh. Oh. That's just like a panel opening to release some fire or something. That's crazy. Random fire appearing from places and I'm a little bit confused. Doesn't take a lot to confuse me. Yeah. Need some fire? We got your back. Here at Aperture Science, we're gonna deliver you the fire. We're gonna serve you with the fire delivery service. Should have looked at that for a start, though. Yes, okay, I see what I need to do. Just looking around, though, taking it all in. If there's anything hidden. to do is this and this. And end up in a cage. Yeah, um, I explained this, uh, I don't know if you, if you weren't part of the stream on Tuesday night, I think it was, you may have missed it, but 
Um, I've been enrolled into the the beta program on Twitch, so that now they're uh, they're they're trialing follow follower emotes now as well. So I've got up to five slots to have some follower emotes. So even if you're not subscribed, you can still use um, emotes and kind of still feel a bit um, part of the channel. So yeah, that's what they are. Crazy, they are follower emotes. Not like we can get back there. Smash. No? Okay. Well, for sure, it's going to have like a smash there. Yes, so I moved some of them around. And I also need to um, come up with some new ones as well. As soon as we have five slots available. Who's there? Normally, yes, but... Okay. Thought for sure that was gonna crush me. Yeah, normally they are, but like I said, they, um, it's, a new, it's a new thing that Twitch is trialing right now. So... Yeah, you can unlock unlock subscriber emotes with uh, channel points as well. Yeah, you are right. Uh, I'm gonna have to have some words with Skyfreight though about this one because uh, I am yet to I'm yet to be able to pick up and destroy any chairs. I am not too happy about. See, I'm playing out in like a worm on there as well, since we play so much worms at the minute. Um, oh, here's a chair. Here's a chair. Oh, it begins. You thought you'd lock down all the chairs. You were wrong, Sky Ferret. You were wrong. Big time. That turret was all over the place, wasn't it? Cubes. Get over here. Now, uh, I'm probably going to want the new Matic Diversity event as well, aren't I? Luckily, I can pass through there. And then we're going to want to do... See you later. Just like that. Cool. Sure. 
I'll be honest, the, the, the turret placement doesn't really offer too much. Because, or, or like how to get rid of the turrets doesn't really offer much in this instance. Because it's just doing the same bits with it over and over again, it feels like. So, yeah. Down we go. Oh, up we go. You know, I guess we are trying to escape, right? Is that it? I think that's it. All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. So, I just want to check if we are up to... We are up to... We're up to big brains now. We are up to the big brain maps. We have got... Uh, Three there from Libby Bapa, which are going to be uh, pretty tricky. We know Crisis, we've already tried. And then Pentathink was another one that we need to kind of give a bit more time to. But I will just have a quick look before we finish. I'm not going to go into Brass Bold or any of the Libby Bapa's maps tomorrow. We'll start those tomorrow. Um, I will, though, take a look at the Midas exhibition, which was recently placed on the workshop. And this is a collab between uh, Joe Fish and uh, Demon Arisen. And there's some custom assets there with, I probably don't really want to look at those. Made approximately three weeks for the Map Labs X Thinking with Portals Chroma competition. All right, well, don't really want to look at uh, too much there. Uh, I don't really know what the idea of the um, competition was, so. No worries, Fumbly. Catch you later. Thanks for hanging. Oh, very nice. I like the art style of these doors and bits and pieces. It's the guy from, I can't think of his name, it's uh, Alex's dad, isn't it? Oh, this looks very nice indeed. The running water and everything. I guess it's a bit like a, is it like a make a museum sort of thing, or it's very um, like early nine, early twentieth century, like that sort of vibe. Like I think it's the twenties. It's the sort of vibe I'm getting from this. But uh, yeah, it looks uh, very nice indeed. Some like library areas here. Start of a partnership. Oil on canvas, 1963. The first meeting of Argon, Strom, Midas, and Cave Johnson. But it's been removed for cleaning. Our founder, businessman, philanthropist, and world renowned patron of the art and science. Somebody's left their cigars behind. I want to be a receptionist. Are we going to say the same? Yeah. Angstrom Utha Midas. What's his name? Oh wow, that's pretty cool. But like the uh, different testing elements here. Sort of floating in midair. Ascension podium. Don't let gravity get don't let gravity get you down. Feel the thrill of flight only a step away. Safety nets provided. Science follows your foot's a compact photon projectile puts the power of all the sun at your fingertips and beneath your feet. So oh, it's just the panels. Aperture walls are far through, though far below the collective statistics standards. These ceramic panels. Have a certain rustic charm. This curing invention lacks the oblivious obvious utility it makes up with in which reckon I can't read. It's many rec recreational applications. I think my text size is a little bit too uh, small. It's like cutting some of the stuff off. Personal gateway transluder. 
Elegant device manifests quantum gateways to transport you anywhere your heart desires. It's mine now. Mwahahaha. It's about self to solve your own pace. If each record had problem solving experience, you will return here and can choose another. Consequence for experience for the experienced man of consequence. Alright. Oh wow, it's not just going down, it's like rotating around as well. That's pretty freaking cool. Look at these walkways. Finest molten rocks. What have we got up here then? Anything or nothing? I guess this is the exit. Okay. Yeah, this is a pretty cool map. Pretty sweet. I guess that's the way we return to the exit, possibly? Maybe. This is the best puzzle in the map. Right, so that's our objective there. I like the fact that it's like all like one map. You know, it just takes us back, right? Maybe I should have put a bolt there and gone across first. Yeah, I think that's what I should have done. Let's go over there, put a portal down. There. There. Around. I want this here. Back and put one on the higher platform. And then we can walk across from up here, which makes sense why this platform's here. here and to the exit right. so next up we got the uh, faith play puzzle It's nice on the walkway out, you kind of like seeing the other puzzles. Quite nice. Wow. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Oh my. Emails are going crazy. Alright, let's need a button on here. Sorry, we need a cube on there, not a button. Stuck. I am stuck. For some reason, the uh, cube can we stick to something. There's some 
weirdness going on here. Almost like there's like a trigger push or something going on there. Okay. I'm going to want to send the cube that direction, right? do a lot for me, does it? Not sure why I would want that. Though I could do this now. Okay, yeah, I do see why. That, ladies and gentlemen, is why we save. Alright, so then we got one final one, it looks like, with laser cubes. Alright, so there's glass there. So we're going to need to get the cube here and redirect it, I guess. Is there a button? No. Alright, well, it should be relatively straightforward. We'll just do this. Get the cube. And then we we'll return back up to here. Oh, that was very silly. We try that one again. Yes, let's. Uh, where's the exit? Where's the exit? Exit is here. We need to through there, through here. through that side. I didn't really go over there and have a look, did I? Yes, I can. Oh, there's a second cube as well. Well, in that case... things dramatically. Um, we're gonna 
have to do that though, aren't we? So, I think it will be all here. Put that cube up because we always pretend. Yeah, this is, we're going to do that to there. Like that. And... I guess I'm not hitting... This one over here. Which we can correct like that. There we go. You may leave the way you entered at your leisure. Cool. Pretty cool map though. Like I say, it's got that. To me, it's got that twenties feel. Like the, uh, it's like thinking like dancing kind of time, like the Charleston, and very like the Gat Great Gatsby kind of era, that sort of thing. Very nice looking map indeed. Cool stuff, guys. Cool stuff indeed. Thank you very much to everybody for tuning in. I appreciate your support. Thank you and massive support there as well. Thank you to all the new, um, to the hosts, to the gifted subs, to the extended subs. I appreciate you all. We'll be back tomorrow, though, starting The Real Hurt. We will be starting Brass Boulders on a Libby Bapper triple header. Uh, you're not going to want to miss that. So make sure you're back. 1 p.m. BST tomorrow. We're going to kick things off. But until then, guys, thank you very much. I've been Nock. You've been awesome. Enjoy the rest of your day. Happy gaming.